So before we get started, I want to send a super shout out to uh, one of my TikTok followers. My man's man, Trucker Mafia, for sending me this clip. Let's get into it. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. He's just going to break bad. Rookie truck driver says truckers suck at backing. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. By watching how he's backing, he just sucks. He has plenty of space. Let me tell y'all something, because I'm reading the comments and everybody's like, Oh, why don't you get out and help him? That's what truckers do. Truckers help truckers. Oh, get out and help him. If I don't want to help this dude, I don't got to help this dude. What are you talking about? I am unapologetically selfish. I am unapologetically lazy at times. Maybe I just didn't want to get out. Maybe I just wanted to sit here and be like, this man sucks and comment on his poor backing abilities. When he was backing, he wasn't thinking in his head, WWED, what would Evan do? Because if he was thinking, what would Evan do? He would have backed perfectly into the dock because he had the skills that Evan possesses. But anyway, enough of the egotistical stuff. Look, if I'm backing and I ask somebody to help me or I want somebody to help me and they don't want to help me, they want to do what they want to do, they're within that right. I can't get mad at them and be like, well, truckers help truckers. And because you don't want to help me, you're not a good trucker. Bro, be you as a trucker. There is no specific like character you got to fit in to be a trucker. Be you. Be good at being you. Be unapologetically you. And if you don't want to help nobody, you want to sit here and be lazy inside of your truck and worry about you and mind your own business, that's perfectly fine. I mind my own business. At times, do I want to get out and help somebody? Maybe if I feel like it. But today, I just didn't feel like it. I wanted to sit here, drink some water, chill, and comment on how bad this man is backing up. Okay, drivers, I featured this young man on Breaking Truckers before. This is the same one that used the Apple Maps to go up under not one, but three 12-1 low clearance. Basically what I've been using for my GPS is my Apple Maps, right? And for anybody in the industry that's been in the industry longer than six months or a year, they're probably going to call me an idiot, but that's okay. This is the same one that was coming on talking, hey, I almost lost my CDLs because I took geometry in high school or college or wherever he, he was at, and he was able to get up under not one, but three low clearance bridges because he was able to stay in the middle of a 12-1 bridge. The bridge, I took geometry in high school, the bridge is curved instead of straight. So I'm like, all right, I took geometry. I know I have better chances of clearing this bridge or this underpass if I go into the middle of the lane and go into the middle of the bridge where it's the highest clearance. Apple Maps took this guy down that route. Now, you're already a truck driver. Now you're back. You're back. Over here shaming this truck driver because he can't get it in the hole? By watching how he's backing, he just sucks. He has plenty of space. Talking about he got all that space right there up in the front. He just sucks at it. Bro, I am terribly sorry, and I do not like to come on and down other truckers but bro man that's not cool that's not cool man especially coming from a person that's using apple maps as a as a truck gps man basically what i've been using for my gps is my apple maps right if come on now you ought to know better than that you ought to know better than that rookie all right maybe he was a rookie driver you're a rookie driver Maybe you guys could get out and learn something from one another by helping one another out instead of getting out your phone and being the camera culture, rookie. Come on now, rookie. 
rookie talking about other rookies? That don't make no sense to me, bro. When he was backing, he wasn't thinking in his head, WWED. What would Evan do? Because if he was thinking, what would Evan do? He would have backed perfectly into the dock. That don't mean drivers. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, man, because this touched my heart right here. This is the same young man that used Apple Maps that took him down the wrong way and he nearly got stuck by tearing up the truck by going up, up, up under a 12-1 bridge. Come on now. Basically, what I've been using for my GPS is my Apple Maps, right? If Come on now, rookie. And now you're back over here talking about trucker sucks at backing. Bro, you only been in the game for a little bit of time, my guy. Your backing ain't all that sweet. Let's go to the comments. This first commenter says, you must was born knowing how to drive a semi. Nah, my guy, he wasn't born. He's one of those millennial drivers. He's one of those millennial cats that only got into the industry because he couldn't find no other place to make that kind of money. That's who he is. This other commenter says, or you can't do it. True. True. Because instead of using the camera to go over there and help out the driver, he used the camera to down the driver. That's that's even back. Another rookie down in another rookie, man. Oh, why don't you get out and help him? That's what truckers do. Truckers help truckers. Oh, get out and help him. If I don't want to help this dude, I don't got to help this dude. What are you talking about? I am unapologetically selfish. I am unapologetically lazy at times. This commenter says, what if the shoe was on the other foot? He was taping you and blasting you all over the situation on the internet. Right. I was just saying this earlier in my, in my live feed that all of us truck drivers is toxic. No matter the new ones, the veterans, the rookies, we're all toxic, man. We, we just not going to get out to help one another. The, the, the internet, the social media, just changed the whole construct, man, of how people's attitudes are. If it wasn't for this social media, I really don't believe a lot of people will be the way they are today. This commenter says, maybe the guy was new. A little help wouldn't hurt nobody. I'm new at trucking. I pray someone helps or teaches me. We all was new at one point. He is still new. This is the same driver that used Apple Maps. Basically what I've been using for my GPS is my Apple Maps, right? If for a semi truck that took him down the wrong way and almost got the top split off. But yeah, he knows geometry. He knows that the middle part of the bridge was tall enough to get up under. You was just lucky, bro. That's all that was. This commenter says, then don't talk down on him. It hurts my feelings, too. This commenter says, how old are you, dude? This dude can't be no more than like 20, 21. You got to be 21. It probably might be anywhere between 24 and 21. That's how old he is. Young Jack. Thinking that he knows so much. Oh, you got all that space up there. He just came back. He sucks at backing. Bro, bro, you, you're not all that hot either. Help others because you will want them to help you. Exactly. 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 If you are a know-it-all in trucking, then, bro, you need to give up them keys. If he sucked at backing, why didn't you get out to help him? But today I just didn't feel like it. I wanted to sit here, drink some water, chill, and comment on how bad this man is backing up. This commenter says, 24 years and I still have issues backing. Of course, we're not going to be perfect. It just takes practice. That's all. A lot, a lot, a lot of practice. And even, even with the best practices, 
you still won't get it. There's still going to be there's still going to be a back and challenge that's going to test you. This commenter says, this is why we are such a divided industry, because we stay trying to put each other down. And we're going to stay, we, we're going to stay a divided industry. We're going to stay, we, as long as social media is going to be a presence in trucking, then there's going to be that huge divide between us. Because all we want to do is to bring that person's struggle onto our onto our platform and show the world why he sucks. Instead of being the man, recording yourself and say, hey, bro, you need a hand? And let that driver, let, let that driver be the one to tell you, hey, yay or nay. No, nah, I'm good. I, I can get it. Oh, okay. No problem. I'm, I'm here to help if you need it. If you need it. I'm here to help.